this down. There's a friend of yours. <laughs> Don't ask, I got a button. I got a dollar that says he brings her back. I said four beers, Mr. Saxon. And I said no Indians. Well, he's quite civilized, I assure you. Yeah? Yeah. Just give him a beer. You stay out of it, boy. My father said four, didn't he? You he heard me. Mr. Saxon and I are about to reach an understanding. Isn't that right? Just give him a goddamn beer! Just stay, stay out, out of it! I said stay out of it! Damn you. You're a damn fool. You're just spoiling for a fight with a man who outweighs you by 20 pounds. He was now, as we speak, searching under the bar for some kind of a weapon. Isn't that right, Mr. Saxlevin? To split your stupid skull and kill your stone dead and good riddance, too. Now leave it! Yes. I want four beers. Now. Well, now the owner, he says he doesn't want to serve any Indians. Get back! Now, you see this man? Do you? His name is One Stab. He's a venerated elder of the Cree Nation and has counted coup on hundreds of his enemies. He's our friend. He's thirsty. I think it was the bear's voice he heard deep inside him. Growling low of dark, secret places. He's a fine boy. You know, we're not here to arrest you. You take me to the woods. I don't want my boy to see. I don't want my boy to see. Let's get on with it. Father! Father? Colonel Ludlow, sir! Yeah, what's going on here? <laughs> what's going on here? Yeah!
be a genius to figure out they're going to come after you for this. Yeah. Alfred? Yeah. I want to ask you to watch over my children. Watch over Samuel. Oh, my God.